Hello and welcome. Today we here at Board Crazy will be throwing down in the squared circle. However, instead of using our fists, we'll be using our words in a smack talk showdown. Smack Talk Showdown is a game for three or more players, designed by Matt Ringler, Dennis Lining, and Danny Margulies, and published by Double Turn Games. It is a battle of professional wrestling promos, with the players taking on different personas every round. Each round is called a segment. During each segment, two players will draw a card from each of the name piles, as well as one card from the smack pile. The two name cards will be combined in a certain combination to form that player's wrestling persona for this segment. A third player plays as the producer, and they draw one segment card and three smack cards of their own. The segment card determines what the promo should be about, as well as where these promos are taking place. Then uh, both wrestlers will get 45 seconds each to deliver their promos. Both wrestlers and the producer may at any time during a promo play one of their smack cards on either wrestler. The wrestler who the card is played on must then alter their promo based on what the card says. These smack cards may also alter the length and number of promos given. Once the segment is finished, the winner is determined. In a game with just three players, the producer chooses who they think won the promo battle. In a game with more than three players, the uninvolved players are considered the audience and they vote on who they think is the winner. The winner collects that segment card for that round and the first player to collect three segment cards throughout the game is the winner. So that's enough of me yapping, let's get to it. Okay, hello. So, before we get started, uh, it is, of course, time to introduce ourselves. As ever, your intrepid host, D. That's me. And I'm joined by a special guest! Oh my god. Hey, everybody. Hi. Hi. Who are you, who are you again? My name is Dan. Dan. Yes, Dan. Is that foreign? Yeah, it's from Sweden. Okay, yeah. interesting. Yeah, it's spelled D-A-N. Yes, uh, it's very easy. Wouldn't get? Yeah, um, I am here to play a special game. For uh, for y'all out there in the internet, what, what, what game? The game is called Smack Talk oh. Showdown. Oh, yes. I thought you meant something else beyond <laughs> Smack Talk Showdown. Yeah, we're we're gonna play a Mass Effect and Andromeda. Actually, yeah, we're just gonna play it. Play that. So it's now this game is now a let's play, or <laughs> yeah, this show is now a let's play. Yeah. I'm Will. Hey, uh, Will. yeah, Will's still here. By the yeah. way, we couldn't get rid of him. <sighs> Graham, Graham is on location this week in yeah. Maui. Uh, yeah, that's not true. <laughs> no, it's called be. priorities. Now we're yeah. playing this game with yeah. our friend Dan because okay. this is his game. It is my and game. It only, yeah. seemed, it only seemed fair. Also, Dan is a professional wrestling wrestling. That's how wrestling. Professional wrestling enthusiast. Yeah. I am, <laughs> and so are these two. So I mean, yeah, yeah. I mean, more is that a secret? Some more than uh, others. Uh, <laughs> is that one of the characters you're doing today? Lispy wrestlers. If it's in here, it has to be. I would hope yeah. so. Yeah, so we're all wrestling fans to some degree. Yeah. So we're gonna be playing this and seeing how well we would do. Were we professional wrestlers? Yeah, which we are not, by the way. Yeah. So, first round is between the two youngest players, which is uh, good news Him for by Dan. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's us two, it's Will and I. You, I think okay. you are older than I, correct? I believe so, yes. That is your date of birth. <laughs> hey, everyone out there. Uh, Dan can... is about three months older than yeah. I am. So, uh, Dan is 48 years old. <laughs> yeah, yes. All right, mm. so, that means Will and I will be doing the first uh, promotions. Well, shouldn't we explain to the people how this works first? I did. He did that in the intro. introduction, Dan. Cut yeah. that out. Sorry. Okay. No, no, we're keeping that in now. <laughs> Damn it! We're gonna make All you right. look bad. <sighs> You'll never work in this town but, again. Look who it is. All right. Well, we just started, so <laughs> he's back from Maui. Whoa, that was quick. Yeah. yeah. All right. Should we get to this then? I think yes, we I think should. we should. So who draws yeah. first? Yeah, Dan. You sure. choose. Uh, okay. So I draw a segment card. No, yes, well, you yes. can draw that. But then who, you got to give us names and oh yes, decide. Well, no, I mean like uh, no, don't don't you pick the yeah, names? Yeah, I think we we pick them. You want to go first, Bill? I'll take the first blue, and then I'll take the second of these, and then you can take the second okay, of yes. that. I'll take. Eh, 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 this. There's just a, a hodgepodge of arms going on. Okay, <laughs> as <laughs> oh, yeah, I should look at mine. <laughs> as you were produced. Wait, is there any rules that you can't look at it? Oh, the smack cards. Yeah, so do not show smack cards to anyone. Oh, okay. No, you can look at You know what they okay, are. Yeah. You can look at them. them on other people. Okay, sorry. Yeah. Okay, cut that out. So okay. it's time to play our yes. names. Mm -hmm. our, our persona. Okay. Uh -huh. uh, names first. I am terrifying baby. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, well. I am the studious flame. Oh, <laughs> okay. And segment one. Ready, willing, and angle. Okay. One wrestler is an Olympic champion and national hero. Producer chooses which wrestler brought home the gold. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh, studious flame or terrifying baby? I would say terrifying baby won the gold. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, Where are we? Oh, Athens. Um, yeah, Athens, sorry, Athens, Greece. We're in yeah, Athens. sorry. It, it gives a location too, like a geographic location. Okay. Okay. Where's our timer? Uh, my phone here. That's okay. That's not good. So who okay. goes first? Um, uh, the let's go with the youngest. So Will starts. All right, we're ready to go now. Mm-hmm. Okay. Let's see what he has to say about the terrifying video. I don't know what to say, so we'll see. Okay, we are starting segment one. All right. Three, two, one, go. So you think you're tough, because we're here in Athens, the birthplace of the Olympics. Well, guess what? I'm the studious flame. I've studied the Olympic torches. I know everything about the way the flame burns. Yeah, you're not a very terrifying, baby. You think you you think winning makes you... you, you give Pause. someone throw a smack talk card at me. Yeah. Smack card? Yeah. Trainer. The speaker must boast about the multiple wrestlers they have trained. You, well, I've trained so many wrestlers. I've trained... The humongous baby. I've trained the happy baby. And the terrifying baby, I'll tell you, you got nothing on those two babies. I've trained Stone Cold Steve Austin. <laughs> I'll tell you what, he was the biggest baby of them all. And he would have tore your head And you're up. done. Yeah. Okay, uh, and that retort from uh, Terrifying Baby. Yeah. In three, two, one, on. Pause. I'm hulking up. Oh, okay. I draw two new smack cards. Whoa. Wait a minute. He can't use smack on himself, can he? Can. Yeah, you can. Either player. Oh. That's why you have one. Yeah, you can use it on yourself or you, or the other. This one's too easy. Uh, oh, well, okay. In the future, mm. I would have used that then. Jesus. <laughs> you wanted to hook up. I did. I don't know if I'm going to use either of these, though. <laughs> uh, all right. This one's kind of, I mean, I could do this one. I. Okay. You, but you, I, don't you know I don't think I'm going to. You ready? Yeah. Go. Oh, I'm supposed to be scared because you trained humongous baby and you trained Steve Austin, Mr. Studious Flame. I'm not scared whatsoever. I swallowed the Olympic flame. I'll swallow you the same. Steve Austin, I broke his neck. Pause. Smack card. Collegiate star. Hmm. The speaker must boast about their collegiate wrestling skills. You didn't hit pause. But ah, sorry. Give him 10 seconds. Okay. 10 seconds. I... I'm an all-American from the University of Iowa Southern. <laughs> Prestigious. <laughs> Go Jay Wolves. All right. Pause. A- <laughs> yeah. The speaker must talk about the annual canyon they bring to the ring. <laughs> And go. As a terrifying baby, I have my terrifying stuffed animal that you know, Bebop, my tiny little rhinoceros friend. He comes to the ring. He scares everybody, too. I'm afraid of anybody. I'm a terrifying baby. I'm nine months old. Nine months old. And you're done. That's right. I did. Ooh, wow. That was, uh, that was heated. That was very heated. Um, wow. Okay. All right, Road Dog. What do you think? <laughs> Well, uh, well, the do double G says, uh, "Ooh, I'm gonna go with a uh, studious flame." What? What? Damn! Was, uh, I, I believed it. I protest. Okay. I definitely believed it. Yeah, terrified. I'll take it. By me? Fine. Fine. I don't care. I was a little terrified by hey, the baby. I gotta be honest. You, it is a terrifying baby. Take a segment card, and I'll take a few of these. <laughs> There's some good stuff in this. <laughs> There's some good smack cards here. Okay. okay um. <laughs> I'm excited for this. I'm real excited for this. Okay. All right, gentlemen, who are you this round? Um, okay, I will be portraying uh, mm-hmm. um, one, of my, one of my favorites in the indie scene. Okay. Magical Sailor. Magical Sailor. Yeah, Magical okay. Sailor. Okay. And I am Monster Grappling. Monster, monster gra- Grappling. Not Grappling Monster. <laughs> Not Grappling Monster. Monster, gra- monster, monster Grappling. Monster Sponsored Grappling. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. All right, we've got Monster Grappling, we've got yeah. Magical Sailor. We are in Worcester, Massachusetts. The wrestlers are siblings who have been rivals since birth. Neither will accept defeat. <laughs> Ironic that you two would get their sibling one, but... Well, it would be more interesting if one of us would accept defeat. Perhaps. Like, well, okay. But that's there. not the card, Dan. It's not, okay. So, you, so Magical Sailor and uh, Monster Grappling are uh, brothers mm-hmm. who yes. have... Uh, 
always hate each other, apparently. <laughs> Will not accept losing to the other. Ready to go? I think, uh, I think Dan should go first since he hasn't done one yet. Okay. Play. A monster, monster, monster. Oh, for many, many years we've been growing up. I would just look at you and didn't know what to do. But now. Pause. Dan, I'm going to test you here. I'm going to play a smack card. Okay. Name that tune. The speaker must quote song lyrics in their promo. <laughs> okay. You ready? I'll give you a second to think about that. <laughs> Jeez, all right. Oh, monster grappling. Oh, father always warned me about you. How, uh, 45 years later, in this ring, we would uh, meet up. And, uh, oh, uh, oh, I'll make you walk that plank. Hey, boy, okay? All I have to do is just look deep inside and just look back at what we've been doing all these years. But, uh, alas, I hear voices all right. in my head. <laughs> you, all right, you passed 45 <laughs> seconds, but sorry. was that the only lyric you threw in there? I, I yeah. couldn't tell. Was yeah, like the walk Randy Orton. Yeah, I think it like a monster mash thing. Oh, that's true. It's a monster grappling. Mm. But, okay, so that was Dan's. That was bad. You're so. committed to sailor thing, though. I'll give you props for okay. that. You can do this in three, two, one, go. It's always been strange to me that we have completely different accents, brother. <laughs> uh, and I also don't know what you're on about, but one thing I can say is that I've always been better at cutting promos than you. Pause. And now you're cooking. The speaker must list off the moves they're going to use on their opponent like a recipe. <laughs> <laughs> Will, you, look, you like to cook? Tomorrow night in Worcester, Massachusetts, I'm going to season you like, with some... With a good old fashioned bottle of Worcestershire sauce. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna hit you with a a, a a little teaspoon of a German suplex. Follow that with two tablespoons of a cutter and then Pause. Pause. Oh. It's uh, similar. Pasta mania. I think I must promote a new wrestling themed <laughs> pasta restaurant. <laughs> That's amazing. Go Wait on. a minute. Um I, but Let's not talk about that. Let's talk about my new restaurant. I call it Monster Pasta. We make the best pesto in all of the tri-state area of Garden Sucks. My accent changed mid-promo. Yeah. It did. Um, I'll be honest. I'm going to give it to Dan. Yeah, give Why? Because bad. You were more middle. consistent. You're okay. committal to the sailor routine. Okay. Yeah, I think, I think yeah. Will could have had that if he had gone like... You know, how he's going to use a sauce on you or something. Mm, yeah. Like the kind you would find at, say, Monster Pasta yeah. mm -hmm. in downtown Worcester. Uh, but, you know, he choked. All right, Dan, that's your segment. He choked okay. away. Sweet. Have you, you have I am the Iron oh, yeah, Silencer. Okay. Uh, <laughs> iron Silencer. <laughs> silencer. And I am Twisted Ogre. Twisted Ogre. Yeah, wow. Ooh. Okay. There's so much fan fiction out there of mm -hmm. Twisted Ogre. There has to be. All right, guys, your segment. Okay. Well, you're in. We're in Geneva, Switzerland. <laughs> okay. It's a contract signing. Of course. Ooh. The wrestlers are debating the terms of their championship match contract. They must convince the audience why they should receive their demands. Tap in a scream. Tap, tap, tap. <laughs> Who's going first? Tap it in. All right. Uh, uh, D can go. D hasn't gone first okay. yet. Okay. He's not. It's fair enough. Iron Silent. Twisted Ogre. Ready? Yes. Pause. Oh. Smack talk. Okay. Snack card. A pack a day. The speaker must give their promos if they have been smoking a pack of cigarettes a day for their whole life. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, while we're at it, I'm going to play this myself. I'm going to play this on myself. Wrestler Esquire. The okay. speaker must brag about their law degree. <laughs> okay. Hey, leave those up here somewhere. Oh, yeah. I guess yeah. we should. There yeah. we go. These are me. The Iron Silencer. A uh, chain-smoking lawyer. <laughs> okay. D, your phone locked again. Okay. <laughs> Like I said, fix this. Maybe let me see if I can go into yeah, settings. Change your yeah. setting time so it doesn't lock every 30 seconds. <laughs> it's ridiculous. 30 man inspect inactivity. That should probably be. <laughs> that should probably do it. Yeah. Go. Now listen here, audience. I don't think my demands are that outrageous. I, Iron Silencer, <laughs> am a lawyer. I pass the bar in like 12 minutes. And I know what I'm talking about. Twisted Ogre wants the entire ring to be set on fire. That's absurd. It's illegal. One of us could probably die. I want nothing more 
than a simple ironing board, <laughs> which I can use to beat him over the head with. I don't think that's unreasonable. Pause. Speaker must give their entire promo using baby talk. For me? No, that's for Dave. Stumps the bell. Oh, I, like, like no, okay. Sorry, I didn't okay. want to make you do a baby smoker for that one. <laughs> okay. Tell me when you're ready to go. I'm ready to go. That's all. I'm gonna hit you. Blah, blah, blue, blue. <laughs> I'm gonna untwist you, ogre. <laughs> you're gonna be a normal ogre when I'm done with you. All right. It's not bad. That was terrible. But <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm right. convinced about the contract signing. But All right. Let me draw back up. Um. Okay, go. Uh, iron silencer. Uh, why do you have to say no to my inferno match? It's been never done before here in Europe. And uh, uh, the flames, they go high, they go high, they go high. Uh, your ironing board, <laughs> it only goes medium. Do, do all of you out there in Switzerland really want to see that? Or do you want to see the flames? The flames. Uh, the speaker must promote their series of fitness DVDs. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Whenever you're ready. The flames, they burn, they burn just like the fat. If you, <laughs> if you use my new tapes, Ogre Fitness, you'll... You'll, you'll twist into shape. That's it. Oh. All right. <laughs> so the point of this promo <laughs> was to convince the audience yep. that you're about your contract signing, right? That about you your demand. Yeah, your your demands. demands for the... Uh, Will? Okay. We need a winner. I sound more like a I smoker. think I'd give that to yeah. Dan. Sweet. Okay. Dan is a uh, commanding lead. Dan's one away from winning <laughs> the game now. We're playing three. I mean, that's not the rules, guys. We can keep going if we want. Let's see. Maybe Will's gonna take one here. You guys are back up. You're not playing right now. You're the uh... right. Oh wait, Dan's up. Oh right, yeah. Okay, so that's good. Okay, yeah, I'm producer. Most counter clockwise. I'm in the van. Okay. Okay. Do you have your your names? I I do. Okay. Let's present them. My wrestler this round is Rascal Cruel. I am like a 90s rapper. the luscious demon. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> the okay. luscious demon. Now, segment number four. Defeated streak in Baltimore, Maryland. One wrestler has never won a match. They must convince the audience why they'll win this one. Producer, producer decides which wrestler has never won. Okay. Is it luscious um, demon or rascal cruel? <laughs> say rascal cruel. Is never a, won a match? Never won a match. Rascal. He's got that defeated streak going. Okay. Will can go first. Yeah, we can just keep the same rotation. That seems fair. Yeah, that works. One wrestler is never one match. That's me. Okay, three, two, one, go. I may be luscious, <laughs> but that doesn't mean I'm a pushover. You've never won a match, Rascal Crew, and that's because you're too crew for school. I'm a demon deep down. I'm going to possess you. Pause. You take over. Oh, sorry. Um, smack card. Rumor mill. The speaker must denounce a rumor about a scandal they are involved in. <laughs> And I should also point out that the rumors that I'm stealing school supplies is completely false. In fact, I'm just, you know what, forget all that. I'm just going to beat you because I'm luscious and you suck because Rascal Crew, you never won a match. You're never going to win a match. And like I said, I'm going to possess you and I'm going to take over your soul. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make you burn in that ring tomorrow because we're doing, also doing an Inferno match, by the way. So. And good. Like uh, wow, okay. That happened. <laughs> yeah. So are you ready Michael for your bow? Yeah. Are you ready for your bow, Rascal Cruel? <laughs> I, I guess I so. Be some <clears throat> smacked up. You good? Mm -hmm. Okay, three, two, one, go. Oh, luscious demon, you fool. I know I've never won a match. Some might say I've lost 189 consecutive <laughs> matches this week. But that doesn't matter to me. I will be victorious because I know you, luscious demon. You have a guilty conscience. Those erasers, those rulers, that chalk you've stolen. Pause. Pause. Uh, smack cards. Meal plan. Mm. The speaker must list everything they've eaten that day and explain why it'll help them win. Okay. I'm down to 112 pounds because I haven't eaten anything in 12 months. I, <laughs> I have subsisted strictly on tomato juice. You may have noticed. <laughs> Pause. <laughs> All right, Mr. 112 pounds. <laughs> Now you're gonna have to. A cop out, by the way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now you're gonna. Okay. Was... 
now you're going to have to <laughs> tiptoe around your use of steroids. Uh -huh. <laughs> if you're too obvious, your promo is over. But you have okay. like 12 seconds, 15 okay. seconds. Okay, we good? Okay, three, two, go. I know some might say this physique is unlikely for someone who has only had tomato juice in the last year, but I've been working on a new move. Pause. Hadouken. The speaker must use the phrase Hadouken to your face during their promo. Shall we? Yep. Three, two, one, go. A new move, and it looks something like this. Hadouken to your face! <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was perfectly done. Okay. Thank you. Ooh. I can slightly more southern as it went on, but I'm fine with that. <laughs> yeah, our accents have been changed. My true colors yeah. coming out. Oh, man. You gotta I'm, give that to D. Yeah, I'm gonna give it to Rascal Crow. <laughs> <laughs> killed me. <laughs> with a duke into his face. Yeah, a duke into my face. Now, I am the producer, and I can relax for a minute. Come on, Will. Crap. Here, take these. Well, if you guys want to announce yourselves, okay. you're my guest. Um, all right. I am a, uh, an upstart um, in Shimmer. I am Mystic Riley. Mystic Riley. Mystic Riley. Alex Riley's cousin. <laughs> Mystic. Say it to my face. <laughs> I am the Great Crusher. Oh, okay. An actual gimmick That's from like the 60s. Yeah. yeah. It sounds legit. All right. The Great Crusher and Mystic Riley are in Osaka, Japan Ooh, for okay. tryouts. Both wrestlers are trying to break into the industry. The wrestlers must tell everyone why they should make it on to Smack Talk Wrestling Federation's roster. Uh, so, who's going first? First, Dan? I'll go. Dan, I think, went first. Yeah, Dan went first the last time you guys went, so that's how we're doing it. Okay, cool. Three, two, one, go. Hi there, STWF. I'm Mystic Riley, and I'm here to show all of you what I can do. All right, pause. That voice has made this too easy for me. We're doing <laughs> too old for gold. The speaker must discredit their opponent for being too old to be a wrestler. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ready? Okay. Go. And my main opponent, Great Crusher here, he's so old. He, he'll he break a hip just doing any little thing. I can do a hip toss to him, his hip will fly out. And he just can't do anything right. He's so old. So that's why you should pick me, Miss Dick Riley, to be an STWF. Pause. I'm going to give you a throw your bone here. The speaker must promote their new sports drink line. <laughs> Oh, I remember. I'm here also to promote my new drink, Mi Mystic Electrolytes. <laughs> Good God. You're done. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Mystic Electrolytes? I don't I, know. Okay. That, was a, that didn't work at all. Yeah. I mean, uh, sorry. I ran, I ran out of steam. Yeah, 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 yeah. Easy to do that. I, I did, yeah. It's fine. I got to draw another one. We, we okay. Maybe the cards are there to help people. That's true. Ready? Three, two, one, play. Pause. Okay. Smack talk. Uh, per perfect. Um, uh -huh. Too green for gold. The speaker must discredit their opponent for being too young to be a wrestler. <laughs> That's amazing. This could have been planned in there. That's amazing. Play. I may be old, <laughs> but I tell you. Wait, let me put my teeth in. <laughs> I tell you, Mystic Riley. Mystic Riley, I'm not Southern. Mystic <laughs> Riley is too, is too young for this. He don't have no, he don't have, <laughs> doing Southern again. Fine. He doesn't have the necessary experience. And he, 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 you have you heard the name of his drink? His, his energy drink is called Electrolyte Light. <laughs> what the hell does that even mean? Now, I weigh like 425 pounds. I'm 87 years old, but I can still crush people. In fact, I'm the great crusher. Pause. I'm going to play one just to see what happens. Personal rumble. The speaker must draw a new smack card and use it on themselves every 10 seconds. You only have 10 seconds, so you're going to use it once. Just play it and we'll see what, what you got. That's an interesting card, though. The speaker must promote uh -huh. their clothing line. Okay. <laughs> good. You want a second? Are you good? <laughs> Pants promo. Mm -hmm. yeah. Go. And I'm also here to promote a product. My product is Crusher Socks. <laughs> They're weighted socks. Each sock weighs 25 pounds each. For the sand. You pa step on someone, you'll crush. Done. Okay. All right. Will wins that. Yeah, obviously. obviously. <laughs> All right. Thank you. It's close. Crush your socks. All right. I'm the producer here. Okay. Dan, you can win the whole thing. Okay. Then we're done. Maybe. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. If you win. All right, before you release your names, guys, today we're in Manila in the Philippines. Okay. Natch. A thriller. Mm -hmm. One of these wrestlers is a boxer. The other is an MMA fighter. Who will reign supreme? Producer decides which wrestler is a boxer and which one is an MMA fighter. 
All right, let me see. Let's get to some names <laughs> before I do that. Fine. All right. I am Regal Steel. <laughs> Ooh, that is an adult film name. Uh, okay. Also, speaking of adult film names, uh-huh. I am Dark Dog. Dark Dog. <laughs> So which ones do you we'll have to see? Which out, one's the sorry. boxer? Do we determine yeah. that ourselves? No, I determine it. Okay, which one's which? Um, Regal Steel. Regal Steel was a boxer. Okay. Dark Dog was an MMA fighter. I'm a boxer. Okay. okay. I'll go first, right? Yes. D's going first. Yeah. Okay. You ready? Yeah. It's not, oh, okay. Dark Dog, let me tell you something about myself. Pause it. <laughs> okay. Son of a plumber. The speaker must talk about their blue collar upbringing. Okay. All right. You ready? Yeah. My father was a plumber in Birmingham, Alabama. I grew up in a small house in the middle of nowhere with my only friend, a dog. So I passed the time punching things, mainly trees. That's how I got these fists today, all calloused and nasty and broken. Pause. The speaker must constantly use the phrase only in America during their promo. (laughs) the kind of bringing up that only happens in America. And I'm going to punch your face off. I know you think I got these fancy MMA moves, but I don't care. Only in America can you find Regal Steel. Only in America will I kick your ass. All right. That's a good promo. Nice. And concise. Very concise. Yeah. All right. I got to draw back up. Okay. Ready for your rebuttal, Dark Dog? I am, yes. Mixed martial artist, Dark Dog. Double (laughs) feet. Regal Steel. You talked about your upbringing, and uh, you had nothing but a dog with you. <laughs> Guess what that dog grew up to be. Pause. Stomach strain. The speaker <laughs> must pretend they have an upset stomach during their promo. Okay. Ready, Dan? Yep. Well, I'll <laughs> tell, tell you something what, Regal Steel. You don't want... You don't want none of these, uh, these grippers, all right? And uh, I can, I know so many submission holds. Pause. Pause. Oh, oh, okay, you, you were going to do it? Yeah. I was going to do one. All right. I'll go. Well, we'll do them both. All right, you go. Well. Inspired. The speaker must talk about the wrestler who inspired them to enter the business. Okay. And, and this actually might pair well. Okay. That's not good. Luckiest <laughs> champ in the world. The speaker must propose to their opponent during the promo. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> you got nine seconds. Okay. You can All do right. this. Okay. Ready? Yep. Well, Regal Steel, once I get you in one of those holds, I'll do just like my my hero, Dan the Beast Severn, did back in 1998 and asked you, Regal Steel, will you be my wife? <laughs> I'll be your husband. <laughs> Boss? Cause that's the end of it. Okay. okay. That was like 10 extra seconds. Yeah, but right. but well, I don't, don't want to end. I don't think the time I'm gonna complain. I don't Regal matter. Steel. All right. Oh, this is this is hard. Because, Dan, you did a great job when it's the stomach ache thing. I feel like okay. a stomach ache thing is easy. I think it's harder to cut the initial promo. Oh, yeah. It definitely the is harder. The initial promo was really good. Give it it actually felt like something I'd see on WWE these days. <laughs> that did. I'm going to give it to D. Okay. That's, I'm sorry, Dan. That's all right. He, I don't he, think he likes you, Dan. He took the Americana aspect he did, and yeah. really embraced it. Only in America. Yeah. All right, so what is it, me against Will now? Uh, yeah. Uh-huh. Right. For the win. Okay. Um, well, segment, I don't know, seven? Yeah, it's seven. Uh, okay. We're in Boston, Massachusetts. Barroom brawl. Back in Massachusetts. The, the, the wrestlers are fighting in a barroom brawl match. Oh, okay. That's easy enough. Okay. That's really straightforward. Yep. Okay, um, and our wrestlers are... We've got Golden Dragon. Okay. Was it Chikara? Admiral... Ricky the Golden Dragon. Flash. <laughs> Admiral, Admiral Fla- Flash. Oh, that is so annoyingly perfect. <laughs> he going first? I... I went first last time. Yes. Okay, right? Three. Drunks immediately. Three, two, one, go. Pause. Admiral Flash <laughs> is a drill sergeant. <laughs> The speaker is a is now a former army drill sergeant. <laughs> That's a naval admiral. Okay. Uh, one, three, two, yep. one, go. Pause. Another one. Okay. That's- Your hoser. The speaker now is a Canadian accent. <laughs> in three, two, one, go. My time in Canada. A we. <laughs> 
we, we get our ranks mixed up, but I'm a, I'm a, I'm a drill sergeant. I, I don't know why we're doing a, a bar and brawl, why we're doing a promo in the middle of bar and brawl, but I'll tell you what, I am going to beat you down with this bottle. I'm Admiral Flash, Admiral Flash former sergeant in the Canadian Highlander Army. <laughs> Here are my boobs. <laughs> Look at my boobs. I flash you. I hit you with a bottle. I'll take you down. And Paul, you're done. Uh, I'm just waiting for my flash. No, he's not fast. He flashes. Wow. Yeah, that's why I never flash. Okay. Sorry it took about a, that. took me a second. Okay. Yeah. All right. Ooh. Ooh. Boy. Boy. That took that was a not turn. Good. Yeah, that took a turn. I didn't know what to do. Uh, okay. You, you really screwed me up with the Canadian girl ball. Okay. Three, two, one. Go, Golden Dragon. All right, Admiral Flash, let me just say a couple things. First of all, not cool, man, all right? No one wants to see your Put those away. Thank you very much. Now I'm gonna list off some names real quick. Pause. Hey, bro, hmm. the speaker must constantly refer to their opponent as bro. I'm gonna list some of my bros. <laughs> Johnny Walker is my bro. Jim Beam is my bro. Uh, Samuel Adams is my bro. Pause. You must constantly shout, hold me back, <laughs> during your promo. Three, two, one, go. Hold me back, bro! Hold me back! <laughs> Look, all those friends of mine that I just named, they're gonna beat you up right now. I got bottles on my left, bottles on my right. I'm gonna hit you over the head, bro! I'm gonna smash you. Hold me back! Hold me back, bro! I'm gonna beat him up! My boy, Jameson, <laughs> right in your butt! Gonna beat him up! Smashed! Beating you down, Admiral. And you're done. That was ridiculous. That was ridiculous. Wow. I okay. apologize to everyone watching this video. <laughs> <laughs> that was a really bad promo. Everything you've ever seen. Yeah, in this past, like, hour. Yeah. I'm starting to understand why promos are scripted. Uh, wow, okay. So, to determine a winner of our first ever uh, Smack Talk Showdown game... Oh boy. Um, For what it's worth, I would like to point out that I still think that uh, Terrifying Baby was robbed, but. <laughs> you no, know, he was. That's fair. <laughs> I, uh, it's, it I think it should be cumulative between that one and, and this last one, probably better than. I couldn't do Canadian. I need to point that out as well, just to be fair. They're difficult. But that's where I was. I don't know why we can't. Well, I'm going to give it to Golden Dragon. Yeah, thank you. Golden okay. Dragon. It's a Golden God, bro. Golden God, yeah. Golden God, bro. Hold him back. Hold him back, bro. Golden guy. Ah, uh, yes. Golden dragon. You yes, didn't well, win. But I you, did not. You got to choose the winner. And that's really um, Which what Which makes matters. you more powerful, I think. It does. I have a crown, up. please? You, you can, yeah. Yeah, let me give it to him. Uh, it's... I'm going to get this all sweaty. Wear it. <laughs> Wear it. Wear it. No. Okay, don't push it down. Oh. Wear it with pride. We need to get pride. disinfectant wipes. Uh, we really yep. do. <laughs> we need some uh, Purell. Um, yeah, this guy's not about winning. It's about having a good time. I had a good time. I did I, too. Yeah, I really had a good time. Awkward as that was a time. Yeah. I want to be considerably more drunk next time. Yeah, but we should play this again, I think. Yeah, I'll, I'll bring it whenever you want. No, we're keeping this. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, we're taking this. It's yours now, all right. I'm keeping this. So, yeah, thank you to the fine folks at Double Turn Games yep. for uh, for making this. Uh, is delightful game. It's fantastic. Well, you know, Dan, we're going to have a review of this game up on our <gasps> website, boardcrazygames.com. Dot com. Well, at least Will and I will have reviews up. I mean, if you want to write one, go ahead. Now, uh, yeah, also, of course, if you like the video, check it uh, out on our website. You know, like it, subscribe to our channel. Board Crazy Games. Leave a comment com. about yeah. what you think of Smack Talk Showdown. Who? What did you think was the best promo? <laughs> besides it's gotta mine. Be, it's got to be terrifying, Besides baby. all of mine. Yeah. Um, I mean, I did say boobs. You did say boobs. Guys, thanks for having me. Yeah, thanks, Dan. Uh, sure, where can yeah. people find you on the internet, Dan? Um, They can't. They can't? Yeah. No. Uh, <laughs> you're undercover. I'm pretty much just on Facebook under my name. Just, just type in Dan. Are you, not, you're not, you're not tweeting anymore? I just make fun of white supremacists. That's all I do on Twitter. I mean, okay. So, and that's not that's, worth it. That's, that's, I feel like that's a worthwhile endeavor. I was... Instagram? I was gonna no. I was gonna start my own Snapchat? like my own podcast or show similar to this, uh, where we play primarily this. Okay. And like with some of my funny friends. You're trying to steal our. These thunder. are my funny friends, and I have other funny friends. Yeah, you have other friends. BFFs. Uh, yeah, and uh, we were just gonna play this for uh, people to laugh at. Yeah. So um, if you enjoy this, let me know, and I'll actually like start doing it. Yeah, and if you let us know in the comments below if you like this or. You want to see us play again? You want to see Dan play? Let us know. We'll relay the message to him. He'll text me. Yeah. Oh yeah. uh, well, I was gonna say via letter. Oh, that too. Yeah. We'll uh, attach it to a, to one of uh, carrier pigeons. Yeah, uh, Mike seal. Tyson's. Yeah, <laughs> Mike Tyson's pigeons. It's a carrier pigeon. It's one of the, and it's gonna be 
and it's going to be an encrypted note. So mm-hmm. you're, I'm going to send okay. you a code that helps the, you. A decoder ring that yeah. came in like a box of kicks. Mm-hmm. Yeah, okay. And they also have social Photos? media. We, we have our social media. We have yeah. like Facebook and Twitter yeah, and all the links Instagram down below. and in the description. LinkedIn and all that stuff. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we have our LinkedIn on there. Find my resume at LinkedIn. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So that's it. Uh, yeah, Dan, thanks again for coming. This yep, was thank a blast. You. Indeed, uh, it. Maybe we'll have you back in the future. I'd love to. Probably not, though. Well, I love that, too. Yeah, me too. Anyway, until next week, au revoir. Bye. See you next week, everybody. <laughs>